Why, hello there, my fellow Fuel Barons. Rodamon here. Thank you for tuning in to RimWorld Fuel Barons of Tatooine. Episode 24, the finale. Glory to the Barons. All right, so the, we've made it, and I can install it. So that's left antenna. Frosty operate. Good, done. And then red, you are going to go for a left leg. Kick can out of the hospital. I don't don't even care. Uh, once she's recovered, I'll have her make her Mando helmet, and then to war we go. Should be fun. There's only two installations on this map tile that uh, have Imperials. And I'm going to try to clear out both. And we'll count that as the win. So I did say that the research would be done today. It's... Uh, Got 76 left. I think it's pretty doable. But, but maybe some of it tomorrow. Unless Frosty... Nope, she's busy doctoring everyone. Well, she is more machine than woman now. Two legs, an arm, an eye. My guests, one is super pissed off, the other is not. Ari, what is your deal? You had to pay fee? You didn't. It was free. You're complaining about a free lunch. Oh, she's gonna rate me down again, and it's, she's just, she has amnesia or something. She has memory problems. Yeah, you're taking meals for free, and your, your, your board is free, free room and board. I mean, what is your deal? You're the worst. You're the worst guest ever. <laughs> Negative four. They did give me Glitter World meds, though. So, they didn't like the... Oh, but they put the Glitter World meds in the sprinkler. Wet medicine. I see. They did get the last laugh. Frosty, no, don't do that to me. Just finish the research. It's almost four in the morning, dude. Frosty, get back to... No, get back to work. No recreation. No fun. Get that Mando armor so I can... I could get done. Done. All right. It doesn't. I don't really need research from here on out, so I'm gonna power those down. Uh, armor, armor time. Mando helm. This will take. Uh, no, I have that last deal easily because uh, of all the stormtroopers that I sh shredded. So I'm missing something. I'm missing two advanced components, and I think I can just go buy that. Yep. And another bionic arm. I'm just going to outright buy it. Uh, Frosty, you better not start that. I would be so mad. What are you... You are having trouble. She's having trouble. It's because, again, it's not a smithing quest. It's a... a uh, 
It's a crafting one, which is totally inappropriate, but I didn't fix it. Now your hearing is 169%. That's just silly. So that other Bionic Arm I bought is going to go to her left. So I might as well just install that as soon as she's asleep. And the guests haven't appreciated my lodgings, so I'm kicking everyone out. They all can leave. I'm getting ready for war. I ain't got time for guests. I do have time to make an extra shirt. Everybody is almost entirely in uh, Crate Dragon. Um, shirts, which is the, the highest protection that we can get from a, a button down. There is a crate dragon out here. Uh, sure. Those that are idle right now can go hunt it. Normally, I would just send red to go bash it. Oh, and red. Looks like you're sleeping. You're going to wake up uh, slightly different than when you went to sleep. Truly a violation of your bodily autonomy, but... Um, I, I, I'm not going to hear complaints, I don't think. Snip, snip! All right, so she's all bionic limbs with a architect eye. And she has sensory mechanites, so her manipulation's even higher and her sight's even higher. The only worry that I have is uh, the sensory mechanites do raise the base pain. And uh, in raising the base pain, there is a vulnerability of being knocked out earlier than I normally would. So I might also make a shield belt. Uh, trying to get a better than a good quality shield belt so that um, I can absorb more shot. We're just about ready. I think I'm also going to set um, my least capable shooters. Maybe not my least capable shooters, but some of my shooters up. I'm going to set Azakoa up with the long reach here in case I need to snipe any of them. Oh, you're working on this shield button now. That makes sense, because the Manda Helmet's actually a crafting, which is lower on the priority. Well, it, is, it looks pretty lovely when it's empty. Looks better than when all those people come. You know what I could do is access control guests only. So it's still open, but only for people that want lodging. I think that's reasonable. So let's lift the lockdown. If you want to lodge here, you're welcome to, but I'm done trading. Three times over. I suppose with so many idle people, I might as well just keep researching something. Portable shields. That could be fun in the last fight if we can get that research done in time. Oh, no! You're barely... I don't know about you, but, like, I've gone under anesthesia, and, like, five hours later, I don't randomly go, Oh, what's going on? So... The shibalt was crap. It's not any better. No, don't play poker. Make your Mando helmet. Hera has been, like, unconscious for maybe, like, a whole season now. 
because of pain. The one reason why wimps are... Wimps can be actually useful in special situations, like trying to tame really dangerous animals, because one little injury and the wimp goes flop, and the dangerous animal um, doesn't kill them. So that's like the only advantage of a wimp I can think of. Or social fights. Actually, they're pretty immune to dead, deadly social fights because one punch and they're on the ground. Do I have a pain suppressor? I don't. I don't have that uh, tech, tech available to me. So there's my Mando helmet. And it's on. Looks a little goobery on her head. But we're ready for war. Actually, under the cover of darkness might be best. So let's go hire a shuttle. I don't have the meals for this, but like, whatever. I'll cope. Where is my meds? Oh, I'm like out of Glitter World? It's not, it's, yeah, it's not showing up. Okay. Really? I used it? No, it's sitting right here. <laughs> I couldn't load it up for some reason. I think because someone was interacting with it or something. So is that everybody? Yep, there, there's everybody. So to war we go. I'm going to go to the further outpost. And I will save. So, Darkstar, uh, you're taking care of Hera. I guess I probably should have checked that you could have doctored first, and you can't. So, let's hope we finish this fight quickly, because no one can feed her. So, get up, Joe Robot, or um, or he, or I'm gonna have to show. I'm gonna have to hire another um shuttle and shove her in and deliver her to the war party. Which would be pretty funny. Dark Star going, I don't know how to feed her. I sent her to you guys. And you're like, wait, but we're at the battlefront. Oh, they're already shelling me. A little fussy, are we? Oh, don't leave that all there. All right, JB, you're going to be Hoover Vacuum. Thank you. Yes. Come attack me. Oh. <laughs> My Mando is ready. Where are you going, Ig Ignacio? Oh, I'll go for Blake. You can run! But I'm gonna deflect! Okay, fine. You can run, because you're forcing me to- Oh, wow, there you go. One shot to the torso. Like you ain't even there. One of the problems with the melee deflect that um, the Vibroblade can offer you is it stops you dead in your tracks. It does not let you move when you deflect shots. Uh, often. Ouch. So it can actually be more of a hindrance than a benefit. We, who are about to slay you, do not salute you. Bye! It's probably pretty painless, uh, all things considering. I don't think that these guys had stockpiled some uh, Resmix serum, but I will check. That's a no. Also a no. 
Still no. And also no. Well, it was worth checking. Reform. I guess I'll bring the foods. I don't really know when they're going to rot. They also had Glitter World meds on them. And send. Hera, how hungry are you? Oh! There's a siege going. Oh, you know what? I can man the mortar with Dark Star. Actually, Dark Star, I have a better idea. Call Freetown. Tell them to deal with it. You won't do social. Oh, I should have made a TC3PO. Um. Alright, dude. Uh, you are going to close the gates. Nah, that's fine. Because I am just going to outsource it anyway. Hey, all of my uh, all of my pods. Yeah, anyone anyone's welcome. Close those. Open this. <laughs> you see where I'm going with this, right? As soon as I get visitors, I'm gonna make them fight the siege party. Cause I can't be shelled. I mean, my shields are up. I'm fine. As long as I have chem fuel in here, and I do. Mysterious cargo. Uh, yeah. Is it a bomb? Let's go check if it's a bomb. It was a ding dong ditch? Okay. Alright. Whatever. So in about a day, we will hit the last Imperial installation on the map. Hera is now starving. Uh, yeah, I'm going to call a shuttle service for her. Why do I... Who said... Oh, they're mortaring me. Yeah, that's right. To keep Hera alive, I am going to have to deliver her to the war party. I don't see another option. Because Darkstar does not not know how to feed her. Their hammerings are doing a pretty considerable number on our battery charge. So run around and power down everything that doesn't need to be powered up. So that we have the power to repel the shells. Oh, that was AC. Leave the AC on. Because I, I can repel their shelling like as long as I need to. Provided I have the power. Oh, really? Really, shuttle? Seriously? That's not funny. Okay, it's gonna take a little bit longer to get there. Come on. Come on. Merge. Merge. There it is. Okay. The battery power is good again. We're now generating far more power than we need to so that our batteries fill nice and up and they cannot hurt me. But look at them try. Now, I do hope that I get um, shuttles to visit. I lift the lockdown, but nobody... Oh, um, no, I didn't lift it as much as I thought I did. Everybody is welcome. Come one, come all. And then Darkstar, you should probably stay home right now. It's not safe. There we go. There we go. All right, you fighters. Prepare to actually fight. You'd, uh, okay. 
He can fire the mortar. Perfect. See, even without a... Ah, you fired it pretty well. What is your firing skill? Four? Oh, for four, that was pretty impressive. Let's try it again. Hera? Are you walking now? I am mad. What is going on? Oh, oh, all of a sudden, when you're on caravan, you know how to use your feet. I swear to God. I swear to God. Her sensory mechanites, still an issue, but she's just magically able to walk. <laughs> troll, what a troll. Darkstar is doing awesome here. He is... It is really... Okay, you have three shots left. Make them count. Nope, nope, she's back down. She was she was conscious for like uh, 10 seconds to piss me off. And then she decided, oh wait, he saw it. Let me go into hibernation again and play the, the damsel. Come on, hit something. Oh, almost. Almost. Almost hit the shells. Oh, there we go. There we go. Got him. So now they're coming to assault the colony, and the valid path is straight to this trade uh, here. So, yes, I assure your safety. Wink. Oh, dang, there's uh, kind of a lot of you guests. There's six of you. Darkstar, don't go on the other side of that door. Okay, you're insisting to, so I'm going to draft you. What's awkward here is, um... Mufflo, go! Oh no! This is getting weird. They're fleeing! Alright, Darkstar, you have some repairs to effect. So, you are going to be able to construct. Or, like, at least allowed to construct. No, don't rescue their pigs. Don't do that. Also, what broke that was steel? Ah! Jesus! I honestly don't know. I think they just dropped steel? I'm, I have no idea. But hey, Siege won, and um, we also got free bacon, as Scorpio points out. And maybe some horse meat, which is, you know, British venison. Or Irish venison. We are a third of the day away from attacking the last... And, uh... Okay, I am gonna lock down airspace... And send... Alright, the shuttle that doesn't have Kuha. So you don't have a Kuha. You're gone. You stay, you're gone. So these guests are literally not being attended to. Like, at all. I can't... Darkstar can't even do social. So I'm sort of curious if I get a better rating when... Uh... When there's literally no attendant... I guess I should run an Airbnb then. Because apparently when I'm present, it pisses them off. Maybe they're just racist. They don't like Rodians or something. I didn't mean to become a majority Rodian uh, colony, but it somehow happened anyway. And last fight, here we are. You know what? Don't even, don't even think about fighting me. <laughs> Splat. Two swings, three swings, splat.
Uh, I think the good approach is from the north. Do the guests have food? I I don't know. Uh, they they don't. Hey guests, can you cook for yourselves? Here, let me try to. I don't know if I could change it, but um. Here, cook your own food. Again, I don't know if it uh, is allowed to be changed, like, mid-raid. We'll see. Alright, back to the fight. Dino just got rocked. Keep that liver in the... Oh, that's gonna scar. Here, I'll help. With their backs turned, they don't see it coming. I only have one jump left. Let's go after Val. So, a few of us are downed. <laughs> a lot of it is just sensory mechanite downings. Um, Dino's is legit. But everyone else is just complaining. Frosty's like, uh, guys? It's all good. Base destroyed. <laughs> No one said it was balanced. Let's fully clear it. Maybe there's Resmac. I mean, I don't think there sh would be, but you never know. Is the guest cooking for themselves? They're not. So, they're probably going to get real pissed real quick. Tatooine has officially been liberated from the Empire. They are... They are not have any presence on this map anymore. Scum and villainy, sure, but that's been Tatooine's way for, since time immemorial. But, uh... But we are now officially free of imp the Imperials. I am now officially the Senate. I don't think it works that way. But I can pretend. They have a lot of random plasteel crappy crummy weapons. Like a Gladius and... Yep, uh, no Resmex Serum. Oh, there's a few survivors. I'll go say hi. This is going to be one heck of a walk home. I don't even know if we're going to be able to get home. I don't think I'm going to be even playing that long to be able to walk the home. But let's reform Caravan nonetheless. I think it makes sense to walk home, right? I think that's, that's more finale-esque. Than just like ending on the open road. So yeah, let me let me hoof it. Not that much longer, and we do have the food. They're gonna have so many mental breaks on their way. Hey, they're cooking! Oh, look at you! I know it's a uh, it's a work camp now, but honestly, my ratings are gonna be better. I I can't believe that. I'm so deeply insulted and offended that me attempting to make you guys happy makes you less happy than you guys just being left alone. I get it. I get being like introverted 
or misanthropic or something, but you guys are just jerks. Ungrateful jerks. You suck so bad at construction. It is unreasonable. You've been repairing the same wall for like a day. At this point, like I can only imagine you reassembling it atom by atom, because that's the only thing that can come to mind at this point. Just, just stop, Dark Star. Just stop. Perhaps the Wookiee smells a little. Smells like he's gonna rip your arms off is what he smells like, dumb. You better watch yourself. Dark Star there is the little engine that could. Oh, you guys, uh, okay, maybe one at a time in that bathroom? You think? I just caught you doing something nutty, didn't I? And I bet you're married. No, you're not even friends. You don't even really like each other. Okay. If you insist. Hera, for real? Hang on, let me check her. Maybe she's actually cured. No, no, no. She's not cured. She just can walk all of a sudden. That was easy. Oh, what? I just got penalized for that. <laughs> Come on. That horse was on life support. I was doing it. I was just, I was just, you know, pointing out of his misery. What the heck? No! <laughs> Solar flare. My guests have been beating each other up too. I now, oh, you're bleeding everywhere? Please bandage yourself. My little janitor bot does not want to clean up your finger blood. as a full-time job. Now what's gonna be really funny here is in the perspective of, um, in the perspective of everybody else, they're gonna show up and there's gonna be a giant pile of corpses Sitting in or next to the smelter. And they're not, no one is going to know why. Darkstar here, if you famously remember, can't do social. So Darkstar, little BB Darkstar here, can't tell them why there's a bunch of bodies uh, lying in the storeroom. And they're going to have to guess what the hell happened in their absence. Because they left and a siege party came in. And Darkstar lobbed shells at them. And then once he was done lobbing shells at them, um, to piss them off, he triggered the traders that are in the trade room to then fight the, uh, the Pike Syndicate. They had a big old shootout. It did destroy the, the table. And then, you know, they all died. He, in fact, he killed a whole bunch of them himself. Because this is technically all his kills. And now he's just diligently um, piling their bodies for removal. Actually, I could probably do the removal myself. Now that I think about it. Because I'm pretty sure he could be able to use the crematorium. He also powered down like all the crafting tables in the in the whole base. And then used the mortar so much that its um, durability broke. I could fix that too. See what I can do before they get home. Like, true Kevin McAllister style uh, attacks there. Maybe I'll try to even clean up all the corpses. Who knows? What's his kill count? Numbers says... It's nine. <laughs> He's a he's a robot with no weapons. Has killed nine people. 
or nine things. I think that horse counted as well. Here, let me let me count for human like. Eight human likes, one horse. Screw you all, and the horse you ride in on is kind of what he would say if he had a tongue or vocal cords. Time to hide the evidence. Nothing happened. A door broke, that's it. There was a stiff breeze and this wooden door broke. What? I'm not gonna give you your my plasteel vibro double blade. Yeah, uh, excuse you. What's funny is it's not even mine to give. She's psychotic right now. And Hera, magically again, is not able to walk. So convenient for her is that timing. I'm not even gonna survive this fight. Red is like psychotically wandering. And Hera's just like, meh, I'm gonna be an immobile turd for this fight, thank you. Hey, yo, Mando, if there was ever a time to like you snap out of this, because they were demanding your sword, it'd be now. Okay, they fleed. Bear, like, I'm not even... So oh, good, your blaster eye scar. Well, we survived it. Would be good, Red, if you, um, you snapped out of it just a little bit. Luckily, they did deliver me, like, more meds and more food for my way home. But I'm getting a little tired of getting shot at, because everybody here has holes in them. Except for Hera, magically. Every time there is any sort of danger, she plays possum and goes, Whoa! Can't move! Sorry! Mechanites! And she's done it ten out of ten times. It is ridiculous. Has yet to fail at the feigning death. Guess your name is Hera, not Athena. Goddess of love, not war. Alright, just a little bit more Dark Star. No one needs to know what you were up to. Your violent shenanigans. Unfortunately, there's no way to replace that door. I, uh... Darkstar doesn't know how to cut down trees. So that door is... Evidence. Yep. It's evidence. There's <laughs> also just gonna be, like, farm animals randomly in the butchery. <laughs> Everyone's going to be like, how do they get there? Don't ask. You don't want to know the answer. And a bunch of random equipment. I suppose if I had sufficient time, I could go through the random equipment and smelt the stuff that's not supposed to be in there. Oh, here, the reinforced vest. This is what I'm talking about that is so ridiculously overpowered. It's a move speed of 0.07 reduction with a sharp of 71 that you can wear under a, a duster. Oh, balance. Oh, right. You can't craft, can you? There we go. And we are... Almost home. There it is. Barely intact, but technically home. Dark Star's still trying to frantically clean up so the adults don't know what happened. <laughs> Welcome home to Smash. My home. Come on, settle down. Okay, there we go. 
This is maybe as stable as the mood is going to allow for an ending. So this, my friends, is where our story ends. Having purged all of Tatooine from the Empire's uh, presence and fulfilled all of our goals. Hosting guests. I'm not really sure what rating they last gave, gave me. Protecting the Oasis and profiting by selling space fuel. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for tuning in to RimWorld Fuel Barons of Tatooine, which originally streamed live on Twitch September 17th and September 18th. If you have any feedback or questions for me, let me know in the comments below, but please keep in mind that this was a one-time streamed mini-series. If you would like to try this for yourself, all of the files can be found in links in the description. Please read the directions carefully because a lot of setup and modifications are required to duplicate this scenario. If you would like to get involved in my gaming community, which helps to determine the mini series I stream month to month and the games that I play on Twitch, please join Discord. The link to that can be found in the description of the video and at Rodamont.com. My stream schedule and countdown timers to upcoming streams and episodes are also at Rodamont.com. Thank you so very much for watching. Special thank you to my Patreon patrons, Twitch subscribers, and viewers like you that support the channel. I'll catch you next episode or an upcoming stream. Farewell, my fellow mercenaries.